Pulakeshi 2 from 610 to 642 Common Era is most popular ruler of the Chalukya dynasty. During his reign, the Chalukyas of Badami saw their kingdom extend over most of the Deccan. Ereya, who assumed the name Pulakeshi on his coronation, was born to the Chalukya king Kirti Varman I when Kirti Varma died in 597 Ereya was still the young boy and Kirti Varma's brother Mangalesha governed the young kingdom as the regent until Ereya came of age Mangalesha was the capable ruler and continued expanding the kingdom however when Ereya came of age desire for power made Mangalesha deny prince Ereya is rightful place on Chalukya throne and he sought to perpetuate his own line by making his son as king. When Pulakeshi II pushed forth up to Narmada, he came face to face with Arshavardhana of Kanuj. In the decisive battle fought on the banks of the river Narmada, Arsha lost a major part of his elephant force and had to retreat. The Hyole inscription describes how the mighty Arsha lost his joy when he suffered the ignominy of defeat. Pulakeshi entered into a treaty with Arsha, with the Narmada river designated as the border between the Chalukya empire and that of Arshavardhana. He received the title Dakshina Pateshwara, meaning Lord of the South, at around the same time. These victories happened between the year 630 and 642 AD. Pulakeshi was the first ruler in South India to issue gold coins. The gold coinage were broad and circular in shape. The punch marked coins had various punches at the edge and the central punch depicting a varaha or boar. The boar was the royal emblem of the Chalukyas. Contemporary literature cites the gold coins of South India as varahas. Pulakeshi's Death and Legacy Pulakeshi II lost his life in one of the encounters against the Pallavas and was possibly killed directly by the Narasimha Varman I. Pulakeshi exchanged the ambassadors with the Shah of Persia, Khosrow II. His reception of the Persian ambassador is depicted in one of the paintings in the Ajanta Caves. Pulakeshi had five sons, that is, Chandraditya, Aditya Varma, Vikramaditya, Jayasimha and Ambera. They fought among themselves after his demise, trying to divide the kingdom into territories for each of themselves. Pulakeshi's third son, Vikramaditya I, became Chalukya king in the year 642 and successfully reunited the kingdom after defeating his brothers. He was eventually successful in driving the Pallavas out of Badami after their 13 years of occupation. A later king of this dynasty, Vikramaditya II, rebuilt the empire to the zenith of power enjoyed during the rule of Pulakeshi II.